Do you want to learn how to create a transparent and shiny text effect using the Procreate app? Look no further. In this tutorial, I'm going to share with you how easy it is to do that. Hello there, Stephanie here from My Prince Collection, the place where I share with you the best ways for you to use the Procreate app so that you can make money online. This is the final tutorial of my Christmas series for Procreate. In the previous tutorial, I've shared how to use the Procreate Symmetry tool to create a Christmas ornament. We've then used that design to learn how to create a Procreate stamp. From there, we've learned how to create a gold, gold foil uh, pattern text texture from scratch using the Procreate app, we've then twisted and applied that texture to um, a Christmassy ornament. And finally, we've learned how to create a transparent and shiny Christmas ornament effect using the Procreate app. In this tutorial, we are going to use that same effect and we are going to learn how to apply to text. If you haven't and would like to watch the previous tutorials or grab a sample of this set, the links will be in the description below. Let's create a shiny and transparent text effect using the Procreate app. Let's open the Procreate app. I'm using a screen size Canva, the color black, and I'm going to use the add text feature to speed up the process. So if I click here on actions, add text and write the word Santa. Now I can select and I can increase this and place it like this. Okay, I'm happy with this. I'm going to click on my layer and click on rasterize. I'm going to duplicate it and now I'm going to change the color to select the color white and I'm going to drag to fill this with the color white. I'm happy with it. Now we are going to create the outline. To do so, I'm going to use Gaussian Blur. I'm going to blur this a little bit until I see this a little bit of this black outline of, uh, over here. I'm happy with it. I'm going to go with the selection tool automatic and I'm going to select this, these white bits over here like this. And now I'm going to go back to my layers, just duplicate this one because we'll need it uh, to create a shadow. I'm going to click on clear. Perfect, but we want this to be white. So we are going to alpha lock it and fill the layer on alpha lock. It. And I'm going to turn this one off and this one on. And you can see that we have this nice outline with this white uh Layer selected, I'm going to click on Clipping Mask and I'm going to go to my Gaussian Blur and I'm going to blur this a little bit like this. And now I'm going to go back to my Actions, Chromatic, Displays, Blur. And we are going to blur this a little bit to give that shine effect like this. And now I'm going to release the Clipping Mask I'm going to select my center and invert because we want to have a transparent background. Go back to this layer and click on clear. Now, if I turn this off, you can see that I have a transparent background, but I want to add a little bit more to it. So I'm going to turn this one on, select this one and I'm going to drag it over here. I'm going to click on um, Gaussian Blur and I'm going to blur this a little bit like this and now I'm going to go to my layers, click on select, go back to this one, click on clear. If I turn this layer off, there you go. We've used the same technique of the previous tutorial but we've applied to text and now if you select this layer you can drag and select any color and change the background if you want and you can add some shadows to highlight this or you can go over here to the hue and saturation and change the background as you please 
and we are done we have just created a transparent and shiny text effect using the procreate app and this is the end of the christmas series for procreate together we've learned how to use the procreate symmetry tool to create a christmas ornament we've then used that design to learn how to create a procreate stamp from there we've created a, a gold foil pattern texture from scratch using the procreate App. From there, we've used that pattern, give it a twist and apply it to a Christmas ornament. After that, we've learned how to create a transparent and shiny Christmas ornament. And our final tutorial, we've used that same technique and twisted to apply it to text, all by using the Procreate app. If you like Christmas stamps, check out my full Christmas stamp set for Procreate or grab a sample of the set. The links will be in the description below. Question, did you watch all the videos of this series? Let me know in the comments below if you did and which one was your favorite. And with this video, we have completed the Christmas series for Procreate. If you missed any of the previous tutorials or would like to check out the full Christmas um, Procreate stamp set, the links will be in the description below. Thank you so much for watching and until the next tutorial, happy drills and illustrations.